Hello students, today we will discuss about carminatives and GI regulators. So today's objective is carminatives and gastrointestinal regulators. These are the agents which act on the gastrointestinal tract like stomach, small intestine and large intestine. First of all, we discuss about carminatives. What are the carminatives? What do you mean by carminatives? So, carminatives are the agents which are used to reduce the gases or expel the gases from the GIT or to reduce the gases, to neutralize the gases in the stomach and intestine. So, these carminatives are very useful in the case of stomachic. Stomachic means stomach pain, intestinal pain and other body functions. These agents also regulate the gastrointestinal functions. So, in this section, we study about coriander. Coriander meaning dhania. Second one, phenyl. Third one, ginger, fennel means soft and ginger means adrak. Fourth one, black pepper, black pepper means kali mirch, kali mirch jo masalo mein spices mein kaam aati hai. All these used in the case of spices in kitchen, black pepper, then iske baad asa foitida, asa foit foetida asa foetida means hing jo apan masalon mein hing use karte hain that is called ferula asa foetida next one apan nutmeg nutmeg this is also a part of the spice garam masale ka part hai isko apan hindi mein bolte hain jayfal after this we use clove and cinnamon cinnamon Clove means long and cinnamon means dalchini. These all crude drugs are carminatives. Means these drugs are used to reduce or expel or neutralize the gases in the GIT. Now we study about the coriander. Coriander means dhania. It is also called dhania. Biological source, biological source meaning the scientific name of the plant or crude drug by which we obtain the coriander. So it is obtained by a fruit, it is obtained from fruits fruits of coriander sativum this sativum coriander sativum is the scientific name of the coriander now we will discuss about the chemical constituent chemical constituents coriander contain volatile oils fixed oils some proteins so you write down volatile oil volatile oils fixed oil proteins and linalool linalool and coriander acetate these are the chemical constituents of the coriander or dhania meaning rasaynik rasaynik padarth jo dhania ke andar milte hain and these constituents play an important role to maintain the git functions volatile oils like the linalool and coriander coriander acetate play an important role to reduce or expel the gases from the git similarly in the case of proteins some proteins 2 to 5% proteins are also available in the coriander now we will discuss about the therapeutic 
यूज थेरापूटिक यूजेज ऑफ कॉरियंडर सिंपल कॉरियंडर इज यूज टू मेंटेन द डाइजेशन फर्स्ट मेंटेन डाइजेशन इट मीन्स कॉरियंडर इंक्रीज द एपिटाइट हेल्प इन द डाइजेशन हेल्प इन द हेल्प इन द मेटाबोलिज्म ऑफ द फूड मेटेरियल सिमिलरली मेंटेन और एज कार्मिनेटिव कार्मिनेटिव सिमिलरली एक्सट्रैक्ट ऑफ द कॉरियंडर आल्सो हेल्प इन टू रिड्यूज द हार्ट प्रॉब्लम्स इन विच कोलेस्ट्रॉल लेवल इज हाई कॉरियंडर हेल्प टू रिड्यूस द कोलेस्ट्रॉल लेवल रिड्यूस रिड्यूस कोलेस्ट्रॉल कोलेस्ट्रॉल लेवल्स विच कोलेस्ट्रॉल लेवल्स देयर आर द थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ द कोलेस्ट्रॉल लेवल्स ट्राइग्लिसराइड लो डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स एंड हाई डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स सो हियर कोलेस्ट्रॉल विच इज फ्रूटफुल इन नेचर दैट इज कॉल्ड एच डी एल मीनिंग हाई डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स सो राइट डाउन हाई डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स दिस टाइप ऑफ द कोलेस्ट्रॉल इज इंक्रीज इन द प्रजेंस ऑफ कॉरियंडर एक्सट्रैक्ट सिमिलरली दैट इज द हार्मफुल कोलेस्ट्रॉल एल डी एल एल डी एल मीन्स लो डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स राइट डाउन लो डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स दीज लो डेंसिटी लाइपो प्रोटीन्स विल बी रिड्यूज इन द प्रजेंस ऑफ कॉरियंडर एक्सट्रैक्ट नेक्स्ट थर्ड वन कॉरियंडर एक्सट्रैक्ट also reduce the blood glucose level reduce blood glucose level in the case of diabetes in the case of diabetes mellitus in case of diabetes mellitus meaning aapne suna hoga sugar ke patients meaning a person is suffering from diabetes a person that cannot utilize the glucose molecules so in that persons glucose is not entered or not absorbed from the blood to the tissue so here coriander extract improve the function of the pancreas that produce insulin it means this extract regulate the function of pancreas by which it increases the functions of the insulin by which sugar or glucose molecules easily absorbed or easily taken up from the blood to the tissues so by which blood glucose level will be reduced so we can say that coriander extract is very useful to treat the diabetes third it also very useful to treat hypertension to treat hypertension hypertension meaning a person that suffer with high blood pressure meaning a person that suffer with high blood pressure aapne suna hoga nowadays maximum persons suffer with the bp problems meaning blood pressure is high so this high blood pressure will be reduced up to normal level tak by extract of the coriander similarly coriander extract is also having anti microbial activity so next use anti microbial activity this extract basically reduce or to treat anti fungal meaning fungal infections or to treat anti bacterial especially salmonella typhi infections if a person is suffering from fungal infections or bacterial infections both are treated with the extract of coriander so write down as anti anti fungal anti fungal infections meaning daat khaj khujli 
if a person is suffering from systemic fungal infections meaning aisa person jiski khujli jiski daad khaj khujli ointment se nahi ja rahi hai it means fungal infection is reached inside the blood then we use ayurvedic preparations that contain coriander extract this extract kill the fungi kill the fungi in blood similarly in the case of antibacterial if a person is suffering from salmonella typhi aapne dekha hoga bahut se persons ko typhoid ho jata hai salmonella typhi ko bhi is extract coriander extract se treat kar sakte hain so you write down anti bacterial especially salmonella typhi salmonella infections salmonella infection. this coriander extract is also very useful to maintain or regulate the menstrual cycle meaning aapne suna hoga bahut si ladies jinki menstrual cycle irregular ho gayi hai in the ayurveda ayurveda charya prescribe the preparations that contain coriander extract coriander extract maintain the menstrual irregulations in regular fourth regulate menstrual function now we will discuss about another compound that is the phenyl phenyl meaning sof isko everyone is knowing sab log jante hain सौंप के बारे में सुना होगा सौंप यूज भी की होगी दैट इज द पार्ट ऑफ स्पाइसिस और इट इज वेरी यूजफुल दैट एक्ट एज ए कार्मिनेटिव मीनिंग एज कार्मिनेटिव तो है ये आप सभी ने देखा होगा खाना खाने के बाद मैक्सिमम लोग मैक्सिमम पर्सन सौंप लेते हैं बिकॉज सौंप का ट्रेडिशन चला आ रहा है बहुत पुराने टाइम से बिकॉज फैनल कंटेन फेंकॉन वॉलीटाइल ऑयल that reduce or expel or neutralize the extra gases which is formed during the digestions in the gastrointestinal tract therefore fennel is widely used as a carminative after lunch or dinner so now we will discuss about what is the biological source meaning fennel hame kis plant se milti hai uska kya scientific naam hai so बायोलॉजिकल सोर्स आप सभी लोगों को पता है फेनल इज अ फ्रूट सो इट इज अ ड्राइड फ्रूट ऑफ फाइनिकुलम वलगेयर इट इज ऑप्टेंड फ्रॉम ड्राइड राइप फ्रूट राइप फ्रूट मीनिंग पका हुआ एकदम फ्रूट लेते हैं अपन इसमें राइप फ्रूट ऑफ फाइनिकुलम फाइनी कुलम वलगेयर सो फाइनी कुलम वलगेयर इज द साइंटिफिक नेम ऑफ द फेनल प्लांट बाई विच वी ऑप्टेन द वॉलीटाइल ऑयल्स कार्बोहाइड्रेट्स और अदर कंपाउंड सो नाउ राइट डाउन केमिकल कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट फेनल हैविंग अ वॉलीटाइल ऑयल वन टू टू परसेंट फिक्स ऑयल प्रोटीन्स write down volatile oil some amount of the fixed oil protein volatile oils like the fen fencon very important fencon alpha pinin and phalandrin phalandrin so these phyto constituents act as a carminative now we will discuss about therapeutic usage of the phenyl therapeutic usage of फेनल फर्स्ट एक्टेज कार्मिनेटिव इन मैक्सिमम केसेस यू सी दैट आफ्टर लंच और डिनर वी यूज द फेनल बिकॉज द फाइटो कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट फैन फैंकॉन पिनीन फेलांड्रीन रिड्यूज द एक्स्ट्रा गैसेज न्यूट्रिलाइज द एक्स्ट्रा गैसेज और एक्सपेल द वेरियस गैसेज which are formed in the gastrointestinal tract during the digestions meaning jab person ka digestion khana khane ke baad mein digestion hota hai bhojan ka us samay bahut si gases intestine ke andar 
बनती हैं ड्यूरिंग द मेटाबॉलिज्म ऑफ द फूड मेटेरियल सो दीज गैसेज आर न्यूट्रलाइज इन गैसेज को क्या करना होता है न्यूट्रलाइज करना होता है या फिर इनको क्या करना होता है बाहर निकालना होता है एक्सपेल करो आप एक्सपेल आउट सो दिस एक्शन इज कैरीड आउट बाई द फैनल सिमिलरली फैनल इज ऑल्सो यूज एज ए स्टमैकिक यूज टू ट्रीट स्टमक पेन स्टमक पेन मीनिंग इफ अ पर्सन इज सफरिंग फ्रॉम स्टमक पेन पेट में दर्द हो रहा है थोड़ा बहुत तो उस केस में भी अपन क्या करते हैं अब प्रिपरेशन दैट कंटेन द फाइनल एक्सट्रैक्ट सौंफ का जो एक्सट्रैक्ट है ऐसी प्रिपरेशन हर्बल प्रिपरेशन मार्केट में अवेलेबल हैं दिस फेंकॉन और फैलान ड्रेन आल्सो एक्ट एज द स्टमक पेन सिमिलरली फैनल आल्सो यूज टू ट्रीट किडनी प्रॉब्लम्स एंड स्प्लिन प्रॉब्लम्स Also used to treat kidney and spleen problems. It means if a person is suffering from urinary problems, यानी कि ऐसा person जो पेशाब से related बीमारियों से suffer कर रहा है या फिर blood से related RBC रेड ब्लड सेल से रिलेटेड कोई पर्सन है जैसे सपोज करो इफ पर्सन इज सफरिंग फ्रॉम एनीमिया ऐसे पर्सन को भी अपन क्या देते हैं फेनल एक्सट्रैक्ट देते हैं बिकॉज फेनल कंटेन फेंकॉन दैट इंक्रीज द ग्लो मेरुलर फिल्ट्रेशन रेट बाय विच टॉक्सिक मेटेरियल्स विल एक्सपेल आउट थ्रू द यूरिन and it is also increase the rbc formations red blood red blood corpuscles formations in the spleen so phenol is very useful to treat anemia or anemic persons similarly you see that phenol is also used to prepare some types of the dental preparations in dental preparations आपने देखा होगा जितनी हर्बल टूथपेस्ट आ रहे हैं कई ऐसे टूथपेस्ट हैं हर्बल टूथपेस्ट आयुर्वेदिक टूथपेस्ट जिसके अंदर सौंफ सौंफ की ऑर्डर स्मेल आती है इनको क्यों यूज किया जाता है बिकॉज फेनल इज आल्सो यूज टू प्रिपेयर द डेंटल प्रिपरेशन बिकॉज दिस इज अ माउथ फ्रेशनर इट आल्सो किल द माइक्रोव इन द माउथ कैविटी so this is very useful to prepare dental preparations next now we discuss about cardamom elaichi cardamom that is also called elaichi it is obtained from biological source it is obtained from dried ripened fruits of elyteria cardamomum it is obtained from seeds of elyteria cardamomum it is the scientific name of the cardamom or elaichi tree now we will discuss about the chemical constituent chemical constituent you can see that cardamom also having volatile oils volatile oil some fixed oil some fixed oil especially dekhoge aap volatile oils mein eugenol alpha pin pinin phalandrin anethol these are the phytoconstituents which are found in the cardamom cardamom is also used as a carminative and having antibacterial or antimicrobial actions so first act as a carminative meaning elaichi or 
cardamom is also used to expel the gases or to reduce the gases or to neutralize the gases in the gastrointestinal tract during the digestions. Similarly, act as antimicrobial actions. Therefore, it is also used as a mouth freshener. Act as antimicrobial used as mouth freshener. Mouth freshener. Yes, cardamom is very useful to treat. In sometimes lung infections, lung infections like mycobacterial tuberculosis, microbacterial infection. It means microbacterial infections are also treated by the cardamomum extract in the Ayurveda chare used to treat tuberculosis by the extract of cardamom. Similarly, you can see in some cases obesity also treated with the cardamom extract. So, write down obesity meaning motapa. In some cases cholesterol level will also reduce with the eugenol. This reduce cholesterol level. Cholesterol cholesterol level or increase the high density lipoproteins or reduce the LDL. Increase high density lipoproteins, reduce low density lipoproteins. It means cardamom is also very useful for a person that is suffering from cardiac disease or cardiac problems or heart pro problems in which person is suffering from high cholesterol level, low HDL or high LDL level. Similarly, cardamom also used as mouth fresh fastener and dental infections. Now, we will discuss about ginger. Another crude drug is ginger that is also known as adrak. इसको अपन हिंदी में क्या बोल, बोलते हैं अदरक भी बोलते हैं भाई जिंजर आप सभी लोग जानते हो अदरक की चाय बहुत यूज की जाती है इंडिया के अंदर सो एवरी पर्सन इज नोइंग अबाउट द जिंजर बट नाउ वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द साइंटिफिक नेम ऑफ द जिंजर राइजोम्स मीनिंग बायोलॉजिकल सोर्स बायोलॉजिकल सोर्स Ginger is obtained from the rhizomes. So, write down rhizomes of gingiver, gingiver officinalis, officinalis. What do you mean by rhizomes? Rhizome is a part of the stem. Aapne dekha hoga jo adrak ka peed hai. Adrak ke peed mein jo jadhe hoti hai. जड़ों से ऊपर थोड़ा सा जड़ से ऊपर रूट से ऊपर वाला पार्ट होता है स्टेम जो जमीन के अंदर रहता है किसके अंदर रहता है जमीन के अंदर वो स्टेम का पार्ट क्या करता है फूल जाता है बाय स्टोरिंग द फूड मटेरियल्स फूड मटेरियल को स्टोर करके क्या हो जाता है फूल जाता है स्वेल कर जाता है दैट स्वेलिंग पार्ट ऑफ द जिंजीवर ऑफिस इज कॉल्ड जिंजर अदरक वही क्या है उसका अदरक पार्ट है नाउ वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द केमिकल कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट केमिकल कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट जिंजर और अदरक आल्सो हैविंग अ बॉलीटाइल ऑयल बॉलीटाइल ऑयल्स प्रोटीन्स प्रोटीन भी है इसके अंदर जिंजर आल्सो हैविंग अ स्पेसिफिक फाइटो कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट्स दैट इज कॉल्ड alpha or gingivarin gingivarin terpenoids like monoterpenes 
mono terpenes diterpenes and sesqui terpene that act as a carminative jo ye jo phyto constituents hain adrak ke wo kya kya kaam aate hain as a carminative expel the gases from the git or regulate the gastrointestinal functions now we will discuss about the therapeutic uses of the gin ginger therapeutic uses of ginger it also as a carminative it is also used to treat stomachic pain also treat stomach pain stomach pain it also used to reduce the obesity reduce obesity it also used as a antimicrobial anti bacterial so these are the basic uses of the ginger or adrak now we will discuss about cinnamon cinnamon that is also known as dalchini aap sabhi ne dalchini ke bare mein bahut suna hoga that is the part of the spice masalon mein kaam aati hai the biological source of cinna cinnamon is dried bark of the cinnamomum jelenicum it means cinnamon is a bark cinnam cinnamon kya cheez hai bark hai chhal hai ped ki chhal hai that is the outer layer of the stems stem ki jo outer layer hoti hai hard hard layer or fractured layer that is known as the bark so it is dried bark it is obtained from dried bark of cinnamomum jelenicum cinnamomum jelenicum this is the scientific name of the bark of cinnamon or dalchini now we will discuss about the chemical constituent chemical constituents meaning phyto constituents that are present in the dalchini or cinnamon here we know about the volatile oils volatile oil like alpha pinin eugenol eugenol cinnam aldehyde cinnam ld hyde benz aldehyde benz aldehyde another compounds are cumin aldehyde cumin aldehyde these all phyto constituents act as a carminative means these phyto constituents reduce expel or neutralize the gases which are formed during the digestions in the gastrointestinal tract cardamomum extract also used as a antiseptic so you write down therapeutic uses therapeutic uses first carminative second one antiseptic act as antiseptic it also reduce the blood glucose level also reduce blood glucose level it also reduce blood pressure also reduce blood pressure cholesterol level also reduced by the extract of the cinnamon reduce cholesterol level now we will discuss about asafoetida asafoetida is also known as hing isko apan hindi mein hing bolte hain everyone know about the hing because it is widely used in spices masalon masalon mein kitchen mein use hoti hai that is also known as hing biological source ab baat aati hai ki hing hame kahan se milti hai biological source 
it is obtained from a plant that is called ferula asafoetida. So, we carry out the ferula asafoetida by incision of root and rhizomes of the ferula asafoetida. So, it is obtained from ferula asafoetida chemical constituent. Chalo. After this class, uh, the remaining portion is continued in next class. <laughs> <laughs>